Harry in trouble. Furious protesters target Harry at Invictus Games, shout bomber Harry, and accuse him of war crimes. Prince Harry, the Duke of Sussex, faced angry protesters during the opening of the Invictus Games, including one who shouted bomber Harry repeatedly. The scene happened as Harry reached Dusseldorf City Hall, where a crowd had gathered to either support or oppose the Games. One protester, Reinhold Burmeer, 68, had a homemade sign that said Bomber Harry and yelled behind a barrier, just a few yards from the Prince. Burmeer's complaints against Harry came from the Prince's confession that he had killed 25 Taliban fighters personally during his military service. Burmeer blamed Harry for being part of the British establishment that started wars without legal reasons and injured soldiers, only to praise them later. He said that the Invictus Games should be stopped, and explained that his sign was a joke on Bomber Harris, who was the World War II British military leader who led bombing raids against Nazi Germany. Despite the protests, which had around 50 protesters holding placards, most of the crowd seemed to be in favor of Prince Harry and the Invictus Games. Some of the placards had messages like we died and the rich make profit and I am against your war. Organizer Lucas Baumer, 26, said that their protest was not against soldiers or athletes but against the acceptance of war through events like the Invictus Games. He criticized the Games for being funded by organizations like Boeing and Lockheed Martin, big weapons makers, and said that these companies make money from war, including the injuries of soldiers. Lucas said that many people who came to the Games did not know their real meaning. Ulrich Mayer, a 70-year-old dairy farmer from Dusseldorf, had a sign that read, now victims, but in the war perpetrators, and called Prince Harry a killer based on his admission of killing Taliban fighters. Mayer's protest was against both the German government, and the Invictus Games, which he thought should not happen. Prince Harry's visit to the Invictus Games came after his attendance at a vigil at the late Queen's resting place on the first anniversary of her death. He was very emotional during the vigil, which he honored alone. After that, he went to Germany and stayed at the luxurious 1 Euro. 600 a night presidential suite at the Hyatt Regency Hotel. During the Games opening ceremony, Prince Harry gave a speech in both German and English, talking about the importance of wearing a nation's flag on one's uniform, and the common sense of purpose among military personnel. The protests at the Invictus Games show the complicated reactions and feelings about Prince Harry, his military service, and the event itself. While some see the Games as a chance to celebrate the strength of wounded veterans, others use the platform to express their opposition to war and military actions. As Prince Harry keeps his commitment to supporting veterans and showing their achievements, such incidents remind him of the different views and controversies that surround his public engagements. Remember to subscribe to British Royal Daily Updates YouTube channel and turn on the notification bell, this way you will be notified when we drop a video, stay safe.